Hi everyone, welcome to this video where we'll go over how to create a new pay run in the Reckon Payroll app. Before you get started on creating a pay run, please ensure that you have completed all required information in your employee profile and company details sections. To create a pay run, make sure you're on the pay run screen and then tap on the plus symbol in the top right corner. Select new pay run from the options that appear. Select the pay date for this particular pay run. The pay date is the date you are paying your employees for this pay run. Next, select the pay period that this pay spans. Then select the employees that are being paid within this pay run. When you've selected all the employees to be included, tap done. A really handy feature is the ability to create your pay run with the pay items for the selected employees copied from a previous pay run that they were part of. You can do this by ticking the copy items from previous pay run option. This means that the pay run items for the employees you've included in this new pay run will be copied and pre-filled from the last pay run that they were part of. This is a really useful option to save you time from creating pay runs from scratch every time and particularly convenient if the pay runs for your employees stay more or less the same from week to week. You can still make any edits you need to on a pay run with copied items, but for the purposes of this example, I'm going to leave it unticked to show you how to create a pay run from scratch. Check that the details of the pay run here are okay, and when you're happy, tap on create in the top right corner. The pay run details screen that you see here will be specifying the items that make up the pay run for each employee. Tap on edit on an employee, then add an earnings item to enter the pay for the employee. Enter the base rate of pay per hour and the number of hours the employee has worked in this pay run period. Super guarantee is automatically calculated for you once the earnings surpass the current minimum $450 threshold. You can customize the super rate by tapping super guarantee and entering in a new percentage rate value. If your employee has opted to salary sacrifice to super, you can enter this here as well by tapping the salary sacrifice option. Tax is also automatically calculated for you, which you'll see here. If you'd like to opt for a custom tax amount, tap on the tax withheld item, toggle on the custom tax option, and then enter the tax amount and tap done. If your employee has any allowances or deductions for this pay period, be sure to add the respective items in the pay run here as well. While we've added the most popular pay run items by default, we know that businesses are unique and your requirements may differ. So you may also create your own custom items if you need to. Check out our how-to video linked in the description on the settings menu in the payroll app for more info on how to create custom items. Once you've completed setting up the pay for this individual employee, tap on done in the top right corner. You'll be taken back to the pay run detail screen where you can complete the pay items for the next employee included in this specific pay run if there are any. Once you're finished entering the pay run details for all employees, review the info and pay run summary. Once you're happy, tap on mark as paid. You can then continue on to the STP declaration page, which will allow you to send this pay run information to the ATO as part of your single touch payroll reporting obligations. To send the submission, enter your full name in the field, Tick the declaration after reviewing it and then tap the submit to ATO button. After you've sent your submission, you'll find a record of it in the STP tab. The ATO will process your submission and the status will be updated depending on the result. To send payslips to your employees, press the send payslips option a list of all the employees that were part of this specific pay run will appear, along with their email addresses that the payslip will be sent to. When you're ready, 
press the send button in the top right corner and your pay slips will be emailed. Thank you so much for watching. Hopefully that's given you some insight into creating pay runs in the Reckon Payroll app. For more help and support, please visit help.reckon.com or join our community at community.reckon.com.